Hello everybody, I am Paola Galdi, International Affairs Representative in Polydesign, and I want to thank you for being connected to Polydesign Digital Open Days, a series of both and in-person appointments in which we will present our specializing masters. Our Digital Open Days are a unique opportunity to get to know our world and meet directly the directors and didactic coordinators of the specializing master starting in the coming month. So today we will have the opportunity to better understand the aims of each specializing master, the educational programs, the workshop and collaboration with exceptional partners, the internship opportunities, the facilities available for the enrollment. Today's session will be focused on business design cluster and we will talk with our faculty members about, about four different specializing masters. So please enjoy the presentation and the final Q&A session where you can interact directly with our professors and ask to them each question you should have. Let's start with the first presentation. I want to introduce and leave the word to Professor Arturo Dell'Acqua and Lorenzo Morganti, uh, Vice Director of the Master and Didactic Coordinator for the presentation of Premium Design Specializing Master. Ah, good afternoon, everybody. The idea of starting this master was uh, coming from many years ago when we used to have our design students working together in the form fourth year before the Bologna agreement with the short uh, three year degree and two year uh, master of science. You know, we used to have common classes with our best business school and uh, because we thought it was very important for uh, businessmen to know the design people, which quite often were considered a bit crazy, mostly the people working in the fashion area. And in the meantime, we thought it was very important for designers to have a common language with managers. Moreover, also the students coming from design in their university cohorts have always been focusing on the product itself. While more and more, we think that in the luxury area, there are the different goals to be achieved. One of them is the kind of experience. Let's think about the packaging, let's think about the events we do in order to get the consumers enter into our retail areas. And are retails going to be physical shops or are they going to be digital ones? So in our master we will be focusing about omni-channel management, which is a very important area of business, both for all of those who will be running a business, but also it could be a good, interesting uh, new profession where you could, uh, in a way, use your skills. Moreover, you will be focusing both in the lecture we have, but also in the workshop we have during the long period of uh, teaching we share in classes, you know, you will be focusing the theme of temporary pop-up stores and events, fashion events, which are very important to promote the brand. You know? If you think about European luxury brands, not only the area of fashion or accessories or jewelry, but also we will introduce you to another big area which uh, people are not aware that in Lombardy we have the, one of the biggest districts in the world producing cosmetics. All the lipsticks and the makeup are produced and sold by the many very famous international brands like Mastacto, Rodeal, Elizabeth Arden, and so on. They are produced here. And so we will have the opportunity to visit these plants and to know how they are developing the product itself, but also how they are linked to produce the packaging for this kind of product, you know? You will also see that these companies, which are B2B, that is to say, not uh, focused on the consumer, now some of them start being B2C. We'll discover Herbolario, which is the first company which is going to open lots of shops all around Italy and is changing the strategy of their business in order to talk directly with the consumer. So, I think uh, through our master, you know, you will see that uh, the kind of uh, work 
you will be prepared will be quite different, you know. You could be enter in a team of a design area in a company, but you could as well, in a way, start being an event planner, you know, or you will be dealing with, as I was saying, omnichannel marketing, you know, and uh, According to also your previous experience, we will have at the beginning some wrap up opportunity in order to mix the students coming from usually economics or maybe literary humanistic studies, you know, and the designers, because it's very important the mixture you will get. And our business area will be developed together with. Sole 24 ore, which is our most important Italian economical uh, newspaper, like uh, Times uh, or something similar in the Anglo Saxon world. You know? Another very important part of the master is the internship that you will be having in luxury brands, maybe dealing with furniture, dealing with fashion, dealing with cosmetics. If I think about my previous students from Southern Asia, mostly from India, from Pakistan, or Indonesia, you know, quite often they plan to start their own company or maybe to develop the family business. You know, this is also an important area we take care of because in the final part, you will develop business plans for the a company you will choose, and quite often it's the company that belongs to your family or that you want to plan. But you can't plan it without a good research of the market and a very serious business plan in order to see which are the challenge that you can find on your uh, inner market or even abroad. Quite often we also have uh, companies where, you know, uh, they want to develop a business entering in different markets. And so I always remember one of our former students, she was uh, choosing to do internship in an underwear company here in the Como district, you know, and uh, there she was developing a research thinking about uh, uh, the Gulf uh, element. She was Iranian, and then she had the clever idea to start a business selling very fashionable and I would say sexy underwear that can't be shown in a shop window in Tehran or all over Iran. So she started a business online you know, because she knew Parsi the language so she could in a way communicate online and she could start the business and uh, we still are in touch with her. She's doing quite well because uh, it's uh, a very interesting, quite uh, new market for this kind of product. We also had other students from the same area which developed business in wedding areas. And here you will meet some teachers who, since maybe you are not aware, or maybe Indians for sure are aware, that well-off Indians are choosing Italy as a wedding destination. Mostly Lake of Como is very popular for that, you know. And so we will introduce you to some fashion designers here in Milan who just focused on this kind of business and developed a specific way to make the clients abroad to take measures to just come one weekend before the wedding to see the final touch of all the garments, which are not only for the bride, but also for the family of the bride, then all the people which will take part to the event. So I think the area in which uh, you will work could be very different, but what is very important, you will get a methodology, which will be the tool that you will use uh, all during your life to face uh, the different uh, opportunities and challenge that uh, life will offer you in your professional life. Uh, we will uh, be working you will be working with myself and Professor Morganti, who in this moment is in China, and I don't know if he can connect because of the VPN problems in China. Here it is. I'm here. 
I'm Lord, here. Would you like to add something, Lorenzo, for our international? Good night, Lorenzo. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks a lot. Thanks, everybody. No, I, I'm glad, of course, uh, of having the possibility to participate also to this uh, short, uh, uh, of course, introduction. And I think that you already uh, mentioned the keywords that is building a common language. This is something that you already said that is fundamental. So allowing both the designers and the future managers to have uh, a common language. So to be able to understand if future marketing managers that the good product is at the very basics uh, of uh, the premium design management. So of the world of luxury and for future designers, of course, to understand that there is unfortunately no good project standing alone without a good marketing and management campaign. Okay, so the, the two things together go together, especially in luxury. There, there is no luxury brand that can do without any of the two. And this is something that you already, of course, clarified, like also the, of course, international class and the possibility for the students, not just to learn from us, which is important, but also to learn from the common experience that they will share together, like the project works, working together, delivering together project. These are definitely, I guess, some of the most important, of course, uh, uh, things that they will learn and they will have a part, of course, from being immersed in the environment of Milano. So being here in Milano, taking advantage of the design week, having the possibility, of course, uh, to meet companies, to meet also design studios and agency that deal with this, uh, with this, of course, uh, area. Uh, here you see projected the formal requirements and the admission requirements and the tuition fee. I would just add uh, quickly that basically the, this is something that uh, many students generally ask us about the structure. Generally, the master starts uh, with a part time at the beginning in November, and then uh, the number of hours raises as we approach the project works, because at the beginning, we will basically focus on theoretical teachings. And then as the masters goes by, it will become more and more practical to finally, of course, uh, let you start the experience that Professor Delacqua already mentioned. That is the one of, of course, the internship, which is fully practice. It's full practice within a real working environment. But before you approach that, of course, uh, we will try to already push you and to help you think and deliver project, uh, maybe and often with uh, already a very, let's say, company and business oriented uh, uh, brief so that little by little we are trying, of course, to uh, reduce the gap that might still be between the world of the university and uh, uh, of course, the world of uh, the professionals. As you see in the this slide, you see the deadlines and all these kind of things. I would, uh, in a way, advise uh, mostly the students coming from Pakistan and India to hurry up to make uh, up your mind and decide what you want to do because it takes time to get the visa. You know? And last year, for example, we had students from Pakistan, who had to wait many months uh, to get the visa and could attend the whole master, which is a pity, because a, a great advantage of the master that you will be introduced in an international class with students coming from all over. You know, last year we had, I would say, 16 different nationalities all together, you know, from Israel, Russia, uh, Peru, uh, Brazil, China. And so I think uh, this is also very important, you know, the kind of relationship in a brand new city like Milan, which maybe at the beginning could be a bit scary because you won't be with your family and so on. But it's very important, the kind of support you will get from the teachers, but also from your school fellows, you know, because being in an international group where all of you will be at the same level, a, making a brand new experience here in Milan. Also, Italians who are coming from different cities around Italy, different universities, you know, for them, it's the first step to look outside their home city, you know, and uh, Milan is considered the Italian melting pot, is uh, the more international Italian city. So for also for Italian students coming from the south or the far east of the country, is a gorgeous experience to be here. And I always say to my students, you have to spend all your 
stay following lessons, but my warm advice would be don't stay here where we are in the campus, but go around and then join what the city has to offer. And we always let you know which are the different options which every week the city is offering because really Milan is a world capital in design, no competitor. In fashion, we are competing with Paris and uh, New York, but uh, being a, a rather small city is very easy to take part to all the cultural offers and all the events which take place during your staying here in them. Sure. Uh, I would like to thank you, and uh, there are some questions coming from the audience. Thanks, Professor Morganti, for the connection. Thank you. You can hear us very well. The first question yes. is about uh, uh, an example of workshop activity that you delivered during the past. Yeah, one uh, workshop, uh, well, we did many. For example, we do a uh, workshop on packaging and on communication, but we also do um, a workshop on uh, retail. That is to say, we can give you a company or maybe we could decide a company together and uh, we you give you a specific location in the center of Milan and you have to, in a way, think about the value of the company, you know, the iconic elements of the company and go on planning this kind of uh, space. Another very important for us uh, workshop is the one we always do on Genius Lodge. It is to say, we want you to understand the area you come from. So we force you to look for a company, which it's a premium company, but you know the different areas from food to fashion, whatever, of your city or of your state, you know. And uh, we want you as a manager to criticize this kind of company and uh, together with us uh, find out which are the strong points in order to develop this company, make it more profitable and in the meantime, more successful abroad. And uh, many times it's also a very interesting way to consider the area you come from. Because I always say to my students, think about yourself in 10 years. Would you, now you would like to work in Milan, Paris, New York, because we are all focused on profession, you know. But maybe in 10 years, so you decide to have a family. And if you have a family to be closer to your original family, it's very important, you know. And so rediscover what is at the back of your experience, of your area. It's very important. Moreover, Designers and managers have got moral issues to develop art and crafts all over the world. We have very famous designer like Antonio Marras, who is working very well. He comes from Sardinia with the artisans from this island, you know, and promoting them in Paris and so on, and making them go ahead with traditional production. But to produce with the skills they have, the taste, the tradition they have, new elements, for what the actual consumer would like to have. So this is a very important element. You know, I quite often, I forget the name, the family name for sure. Usually I use the Christian name of the students, but I always connect the students with the brand they choose because we work a lot on that. And so I always say, oh yeah, this is the Albanian, this is the, uh, Israelian, this is the one from Brazil, because uh, it's very important to know uh, the brand they choose, why they choose it. It's also a way to understand what will be your specific interest and the uh, opportunity you could have in your future. Thank you. A student from India is asking us which kind of cultural trip or study tour, which location are you going, to, are they going to visit? Yeah. Uh, first of all, we always give you the idea to make a kind of uh, card which all, uh, lets you enter all kind of museums in uh, the wool of Lombardy, you know. Uh, usually, we take you to visit a tycoon villa, which is uh, a very specific uh, 
building in the center of Milan, which is Milanetti Campiglio. And then uh, during your stay here, you will have uh, the design week. The design week is unique in Milan because uh, there is a fair, which is very important to visit because it's very important for business. But what is very interesting for you will be the number of events outside the fair, which is impossible to attend all of them. So this year, there were 1,200. It was a way to, in a way, understand them, you know, to see them, to see how they are planned, what they are offering. You know? Moreover, Lorenzo is quite open taking you to visit companies, which is also very interesting. Textile companies, you know, or maybe cartel, which has got also a museum, you know, plastic furniture. Cartel is a brand which is selling very well in Asia because of the color they can have, because of the quite reasonable price compared to other high-end pieces of furniture, high-end brands, you yes. know, and uh, these are the kind of visits. Moreover, we always give you options during weekend, but uh, that is not compulsory because uh, your family is already helping you to live in Milan. It's already expensive, so we can't oblige you to take train tickets, even if in Italy it's rather cheap, you know, but uh, we make uh, visits uh, kind of program to visit Florence, Venice, Genoa, and Turin, which are nearby, and you can reach them in um, maximum three hours, but with fast train, in one hour you are in Turin, in one hour and a half in Florence, you know, but also the countryside, because the Italian countryside is magic, so if you have the options yes. to go to we, or, we definitely suggest that you take advantage of this. Yeah. No, sorry for the interruption. I said we definitely suggest that you take advantage of your free time to do some extra visit. And of course, as Professor Delacqua said, we also plan visit during the Masters. Uh, this year, the factory was mentioned in was Candiani Micro Factory, which was interesting not only for the production, but also for the retail format. So whenever possible, we also tend to associate the visit that we do to some of the specific areas that has, uh, it has been already highlighted are within the field of the project works that are, of course, communication, product and retail. So we tend to associate this also to our visit. And indeed, it's absolutely undeniable that uh, the design week uh, this year is of course has been of course this very very interesting we also had the possibility to see the uh special venues and the special installation by hermes by vuitton so some of the let's say big names of the world of fashion they are generally all here in milano and of course we uh, don't just focus on the big names but we also try to see what is interesting in terms also of uh, of course experience in terms of uh, installation because they all are very interesting case studies for what you're supposed or you might be doing in, uh, in your future career. So definitely, these are very, very good suggestions. Don't just limit yourself to the visit that we organize, but take advantage whenever you have time and whenever you have possibility also to see Italy and to see uh, what the territory can offer to you here around in Milano and outside Milano. Thank you, Professor Morganti. If we have time, I ask to the control room, uh, there is a third question. Uh, it's about uh, the topic of the master. Is it just about fashion or are we going to, to talk about other clusters? No, no. Uh, the subjects are very different. You have communication, you have retail, you have history of design, you have also history of fashion. But the focus is on premium areas, which are not only fashion but it's also furniture, for example, because uh, Italy is very strong for the so-called free air, fashion, furniture, and food, you know? So we will look at all these different areas. And uh, that will be also focus on how you deliver this kind of products. For example, which is the kind of services for tourism hotels, for example, which for Italian students is a very interesting area because we need to improve the quality of our hotel. But you will discover that from a retail point of view, Milan is really very innovative, you know? And because those international companies want to make uh, the new and taste the market here in Italy, doing international uh, uh, 
uh, experiences, you know. Even we worked a few years ago with Bayernsdorf, that maybe you know Nivea Ukraine, you know. They were planning special events here in Italy in order to see if they could later develop them in other areas of the world. Okay. So uh, I want to thank uh, you, Professor, for the inspiring uh, presentation, for the passion that you have uh, since long time in this specializing master. I want to thank Professor Morganti connected in a thank you. strong time in, from China. Thank you. And, and uh, stay with us, guys. Just, we just have a break, uh, five minutes, and then we pass to the next session, strategic design.